Well, hey everybody, it is Erin Reed. I'm sorry, I'm a tiny bit late jumping in and getting live on this new product showcase here at Creativation 2020. But we are gonna walk around and I'm gonna flip the camera around so you guys can actually see what is going on on the other side of this. So we're actually in the showroom, but they have it all blocked off. So let me show you. So they actually have all the curtains blocking everything right now. So you can't see what is happening on the showroom floor beyond the showroom showcase. Let's go one step at a time and see who we can talk with and find out what is the new products. All right, we are live on YouTube. Is that okay? Awesome, all right, so what do we got here? We are sewing a product called Burn Stencil, and it's a metal stencil that can be placed atop wood, and then using a small torch, like this creme brulee torch, you burn the opening, and then within a few seconds, you're left with this image, and simply uh, put a little clear coat on top of it, and Very cool. you can, embellish as much as you like. The nice thing about it is because it is metal and it's rigid, mm -hmm. it can be used in other ways too. We use it to do metal embossing with copper foil or whatever type of foil. And then you can also use it to do paint stenciling as well on fabric, on flat surfaces like wood. So, and we just, it, it's, it's open to all kinds of possibilities. That is so cool, I love it. Thank you so much. All right, we're gonna span back up. I'm sorry if I keep getting the floor. Here we go, spanning back up. Hello, Marion. Okay, we're gonna go, whoops, here we go around. All right, we briefly ran into these people. Hello again. All right, I'm gonna span down. You wanna give me a little spiel here? We are live on YouTube. We are live. We are live. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is Would You Bend. It is a wood product that is put into a cast molding and under four tons of pressure for two days, giving us very, very intricate detail, but also allowing us to heat it up and it become malleable, which is wonderful for mixed media artists. So cool. And since it is wood, it acts like wood. So you can sand it, drill it, nail it, paint it, stain it, anything that you'd like. But here, now you can put it on anything with simple wood glue. So here we have Petunia, who is a dough, a skull, and she has been steampunked. And then we have a gourd birdhouse, which has also been steampunk. I see a theme going. There is a little bit of a theme little going. little theme going on. And then, you know, different, we have different elements in our booth, but. That's awesome. So it is a phenomenal product that was just been out in the last six to eight months. And you said you are going to be doing demos in oh, your booth. Absolutely. About oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. we're so going to be making lots and lots of stuff. I will be going back to this booth, and we're going to get a demo about exactly how this works because my brain's having a hard time kind of like yeah. getting around this. So I will be around. Don't worry. We'll Perfect. Come back. We All look right. forward to it. Thank Bye. you. Bye. Oh, okay, stand back up. Hang on, hang on. No. Nope. I got to get, nope. get, get my what? camera gimbal. All right. Uh, yeah. Uh, 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 Bye. <laughs> okay, so here we go. Okay. So now, some people have a person standing next to their booth, but not everybody does. So here is a new one from OLFA, and I'm guessing it's a new, let me go this way. This is a new blade system. I'm guessing it's got, like, I guess it's a retractable blade system. So there we go. It's a beginner craft knife. That's what it says inside the booth. All right, so over here we have plaid, and we're gonna get some more information about plaid. We have their new FX plaid paints over here. I don't seem to have anybody who's here right now. So here is, look at these cool colors. I love it. Nuclear neon. That's awesome. And then here is their new. That stuff is awesome looking. Very cool. And there's another one over here. Yeah. More colors. I paid her for it. And I love her. We do. Smart to like sneak in there with it. Totally sneaking in with my little tool. Yeah. All right, who we got over here? American Crafts. Ooh. Turn everyday objects into molds. So can you go, can you go ahead and share yes. what we have here? Sure. All right, yeah, so you're a dual. Is, okay, this is our press. Um, this allows you to create uh, molds out of everyday objects. So I like to think of it as kind of a, a low-tech, accessible 3D printer. What? It's really easy to use. Oh, you were, I thought you were like, yes, like, not a um, And oh basically God, what yeah. you do is you put your plastic sheet into here. It's going to melt it, kind of, and soften it. And then you hook it up to your at-home vacuum. Everybody has a vacuum. You're just going to put the hose in the back. Is it like a vacuum cleaner? 
a vacuum yes. cleaner. Okay, yes. just making sure you weren't talking like something like, okay. Nope, just Check your vacuum it. cleaner. Um, it's going to fit most hose sizes. It comes with a little adapter. And uh, between the, the softened plastic and the suction of your vacuum, it's going to mold and form around whatever object you've placed in here. So for example, right now we have a seashell that we put in here. And you can see that the plastic has molded and formed around it, giving incredible detail. And then with that, we've turned it into a candle and a piece of chocolate. And uh, we actually use the plastic itself as a, as a shaker car. I like the shaker part the best. <laughs> Isn't that cool? That's so you best. said that with chocolate, so it can be food safe? It's food safe, yeah. Absolutely. That is awesome. And do you, do you buy the refill pl uh, plastic? Yeah, so we just sell sheets of plastic sheets. They're uh, uh, 6.75 inches squared. And uh, we sell them in a six pack and a 40 pack. Hey, so kind how's of it going? Uh, this is fascinating. Are these available now? No, it's going to be shipping um, in May. All right. All right. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome. Uh, are you going to be doing demos of this in yes, the show? Awesome. So, we'll get a demo because yeah. this is awesome. I love yeah, this thing. <laughs> Thank it's you. Really impressive as a demo. It's awesome. Really All right. Yeah. 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 Up and over. Here we go. Round we go. Yeah. Oh, more plaid. More plaid. More plaid. Okay. So here we have. Let me get my camera going the right direction here. The, here we have their. Oh, so they came out with treasure gold. Last year, I think, they came out with Treasure Gold, so now there's other golds that are going with it. Do you want to talk? There's 12 new right. colors in Treasure Gold. So cool. Are we going to learn about it in the morning? You will. Oh. Awesome. All right, so here we got some, tri oh, here we got our Glitterific icons. So this one's got some more stuff in it, new Ooh. icons and polka dots. What's different about the icons? Just chips. So oh, what's inside of it? Oh, moons. I see. They're on top. Okay, so now I'm getting the clue. On the tops of the bottles, they got the shapes of what's inside of it. So we got butterflies and stars and moons, cool arts. And do those come in the multiple colors as no, well? No, just these, these four those skews four in the icons, and then we have six skews in the polka dots. Oh, cool. Very cool. You want to follow me over here and tell me what this is? <laughs> Since we're here. Uh, so this is folk art pouring. It's already pre-mixed, so it has the pouring medium included in it. Uh, we have, uh, I think, 13 different colors in the pouring medium, including two metallics. And then we also have pouring medium. We'll make any acrylic paint into a pouring Right. Paint. So you, you guys know. sent me that already, so I have to go oh, over and play with that. <laughs> All right. Awesome. And then what's on the other side? Uh, this is our new artist pigment. Okay. So this is a highly pigmented, uh, very thick, rich formula for artists. Uh, it's very flexible, very versatile. Uh, do anything from impasto, real thick and, 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 and heavy lay down, to um, actually doing kind of a wash and do more of a, a watercolor effect. Very cool. Now I saw the ones that were behind us. Yeah. Yeah. FX. What's all the FX? Move my camera around, guys. Okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. So what's the whole deal with the FX? FX is a completely new formula. It's a flexible paint uh, for use on EVA foam. So oh, the nice. biggest thing uh, in cosplay, all of these things that you see are right. made, out, made out of EVA foam. So this product won't crack, won't peel, you know, as you flex the EVA foam. Very, very cool. And obviously lots of colors. Lots of colors, uh, as well as templates and brushes and all kinds of different very, tools. Very, very so, cool. Yeah, yeah. Well, thank you so much. You. All right, we're going to be talking a lot more about Plaid, about all this stuff. This but is right up my alley. Uh, it's awesome. It is awesome. <laughs> okay, we're going to keep on moving down the way. We got another one. Oh, there's a demo over here. So what do we have here? We're live on YouTube. Oh, this is the Dynasty New Water Lily brush. And this is absolutely perfect for any type of a fluid media, right? Whether it is watercolor or um, fluid media or a uh, ink, any of that, it's absolutely wonderful. It holds a lot of fluid paint you can go a long way. It releases really, really nicely. These are brand new, available about April. Beautiful. You can get fine little detail with it as well as big broad strokes. Super, super soft bristles that hold a lot of fluid paint. Water Lily by Dynasty. I love my Dynasty brushes. You guys are the only brush I use. Uh, so, I mean, they're fabulous. Thank you nice, so much. All right, you. I'm gonna grab this so I don't forget what it is. All right, okay, moving on, on we got the next one. All right, there is like free snacks and drinks and all that, I'll get that after we're done. All right, so we've got the Marvy LaFlex pens. Great for calligraphy, hand lettering, journals, and planners. 
So here we got a whole bunch of the flex pens. We're gonna go ahead over and talk to Marby when they open up their show. For, so we might be having some video with Marby either live or recorded, we'll see. Depends on how much, we'll get there. We'll get there, don't worry, Liz. Everybody who's watching, don't worry. So we have their new LaFlex pen. Love my Marby pens, they're so good. All right, moving on over. We're gonna go up and down and up and down. So what do we have here? Here we have the new stickles. Oh, hi everybody, hey Marion. All right, so here we have the new stickles and jump in and ask questions, but I'm trying to get as many. So stickles, this is a world is out glitter, assorted holographic shapes and glitters at sparkle and shine. This is by Ranger, easily spreadable, apply directly to surface through a stencil, let dry naturally or speed up and heat it too. Hey, hey Gail, how you doing? So that's a new one by Ranger. So basically they're taking stickles and putting it in a jar so you can use it as a spreadable item, which I think is awesome. We have another one over here with Ranger. I'm just gonna keep my camera down for right now unless we need to show somebody so you guys can see the products. So here we have archival inks, here we go. So more, but these are waterproof, permanent acid free, maybe new colors, so pretty cool stuff. So with water-based dye ink, we got with watercolor, with acrylic paints. So we have Seafarer, I saw, oh sorry, Sundays. Here we go. Um, seagrass, coastal coral, so you can see the words. With perfect, great with perfect pearls, great with markers. So they've had, Rangers had their inks out for a while with alcohol. This one's pearl pebble. And then the last one that I didn't get a chance to show you, or I, you saw it, but I didn't say it, was a Lighthouse. So there we go. All right, moving on to the next one down the line. All right, I'm trying to get here. So here we have Design Master Color Tool. They have a whole bunch of spray paints. Anybody here by Design Master? People are standing around. Okay, nope. All right, so here we have Design. Okay, so versatile color, color tool spray colors, both delicate and durable. Lots of colors. So new sprays. All right. I always go the wrong way on my camera. All right, so here is Lynn Lily. You guys know how I love my Lynn Lily. She launched, and I kind of hinted at this earlier. She has launched, and you saw her in action with her new Sherp Bonder hot glue gun. This is a cordless. All right, this is a cordless hot glue gun that she has been. We we put the entire booth together with this little sucker. It was awesome. We had a whole bunch of them going, and um, over at the Help Heal Veterans. And so she is here. She's chatting. Do you want to say anything about this thing? I do. All right, actually. So. Go for it. Hi, Amy. How are you? So she's going to say hi. Hi. Guys. Um, I would like to introduce you to the. Yes, yeah, glue gun on the market. It's so pretty. Um, you can see my name, but in partnership with Sherponder, the best glue gun company on the market. Yes. They are amazing. Um, it's cordless, which makes it even more amazing. It made um, it so easy putting up all that booth stuff. Absolutely, we, were going up we used it yesterday when we built out a booth. We were fighting over it. Um, one of my other favorite things you'll see there's a colored glue stick. In there. Yes. Oh yes, stick? yes. There's a pink one. So Sherponder makes. Glitter glue, colored glue, so you not only glue with it, but you can also decorate with it. That is awesome. So you can put it in the molds, and you can have all kinds of fun. Really fun stuff. We are going to be making keychains tomorrow. Like, that's six so of those unicorn Oh, hey girl! <laughs> <laughs> hey, Lindsay from Shrimp Salad Circuit. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. So th <laughs> She's there was an the avid user of the Lynn Lily Shrimp on her Remember we had the conversation the other night with the Shrimp Salad yeah. Circus? Yeah, here she is again. Hey, yeah, with the again. amazing name. Shrimp Salad Circus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Love it. Um, that's all I've got to say, Erin Reed. But I love you. Erin Reed has been an amazing help to me. Aw, uh, okay. well I loved helping you, so thanks. Um, okay, I feel, I feel awkward. Now I'm going to move on. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. Moving on. All right, here we go. All right, we're gonna go to the next booth. All right, life of the party. These are um, soaps, I think. So this is like a soap kit. Uh, Detergent-free soaps. So all the different soaps and things that you would need to do. There we go. I haven't really done much with that. So there we go. And then over here, are you guys? Yes. All right. So we live on YouTube. Oh, hi. Give me your spiel. Hi, YouTube. Uh, I'm Mary Ellen, this is Bob. We wrote a book on how to airbrush. It's a complete step-by-step -step course on airbrushing. And uh, we start you out with the very beginning where you're, you learn what to do with the airbrush. And we take you through 50 lessons. And okay. there's an accompanying workbook page that goes with each of the lessons. Very cool. Yeah. So is it the brush, the book you're selling, or the brush, or the, the, the whole the thing? The, the book. book. The book. Yes. The book. Got it. Yes. Okay. Yeah, cool. and uh, these are samples of our artwork. So you, if you put yourself to it, you can get as good as you want with the airbrush. And there's so many I, different I doubt applications. that, that I will ever get that good, but I will definitely start trying. That's, that's easy. That's the end. What we cover inside the book is the tools that you can use right. to then get to that level. 
And so you don't have your own airbrush, so you can use whatever you like. Yes. Right? You're just right. like, guiding people about how to do it and exactly. how to start so it doesn't look so daunting. Yeah, yes, yes. exactly. Right. And there's so many different applications for the airbrush. I mean, from fingernails to cakes to doing what we do, motorcycle helmets. There's so cool. much. T-shirts, everything. Oh, t-shirts. Right, yeah, airbrush. Yeah, yeah. You, yeah. I don't, yeah, so, you don't you yeah. think about like on something or like right. on a mural, but then there's, yeah, like you said, fingernails. They always do it on cakes. Do you see like yeah. cake tattoos? Cake they even oh, got them on oh. tattoos the and body, stuff now. Body painting. Yeah. Body, yeah. body painting and yeah. everything. So, so. We're, we're excited for people to get excited about airbrush. Awesome. Well, thank you so thank much. You. Thanks thank for you. Yes. Appreciate it. All right, we're going to keep on going. So here we got Art Bin. Oh, let me go up a little bit. So here we have Art Bin. You guys want to talk? We're live on YouTube right now. You want to give us your spiel? <laughs> you can have that to me, honey. I have got my drink yet. That's coming. <laughs> All right, so final storage. I love this. Yeah, so this is our tower. It's new for 2020. Uh, you can hold 36 rolls in a single tower. Wow. The other nice thing is the tower can be stacked. We recommend no more than too high, but still too high. That's 72 rolls of vinyl in there. The brackets are even um, intentionally designed that you have a bulk storage area on top. So if you got those... Um, small little uh, blade housing units you're constantly using or just tools that you're always reaching for. Right. It's a perfect spot for you. Is there like a weight limit to how much can go into each of the rolls? Because sometimes you get really fat rolls, you know what I mean? Yeah, we haven't come up with uh, an exact weight limit at this moment. We haven't seen any issues. Our engineering team did a fantastic job focusing on stability with this, um, which is also though why we say no more than too high. Right. Just to make sure any tipping hazards, little children, things like that. Very cool. Um, is there something on the other side? There is something on the other There's more. Side. Yes. Right, so, so another new in. product for 2020 we have in the showcase is our desktop organizer. You will see it propped right now with a lot of paper crafting tools. So you've got your spreaders in the front. There's slots to specifically hold them up. You'll notice the blade housing units are uh, able to fit in there. Your markers, all your tools, your picks, um, stylus. Uh, this also has been designed where if you're not a paper crafter, you can still use it. Knitting needles, okay. crocheting needles, um, common and popular fine artist markers like Hobix will right, fit in right, here. Right. Prismas will fit in here. Um, exacto knives, erasers in the front bulk storage area, pencil sharpeners. So it's another great desktop organizer to have everything at your fingertips. So when are these available? Now our vinyl storage tower is available today. We were happy to announce it and it's available immediately. Our desktop organizer we announced today and will be available in roughly four weeks for purchase. Cool. Uh, you can find us uh, artbin.com, Amazon, Joann's, Hobby Lobby, Michael's. You guys are all over. Yeah. Yep, yeah. all over. I got it. Well, thank you so thank much. Thank you. All right, so I got to do, hang on, I got to expand up. I got to go the wrong way. Okay, so I'm going to do a quickie because I got an amazing announcement to make. Hey. Hey! So, How are you? who just bought and is now the owner of Joy Claire Stamps? Oh, no! <laughs> Yes, I am so happy. That is amazing. I am so, so I, okay, happy. cookie hug. I am so proud of you. I am so happy. <laughs> you, awesome. you, all my friends are a blessing to me. Yeah. And I am so happy, not only for Joy Clay. I am so happy because I have friends. Yes. That feel my happiness and feel everything. And all are very, very, very special with me. Oh, it I am so, it, I know, you were so excited. And I saw, she's got to, okay, we're going to, I'm going to do this because this is, just, and you got to come in here. Okay. So we're doing, let's get yourself in here. <laughs> come on, Donna. All right, so yes, we're doing an impromptu. So hi, say hi to Donna. Hello. <laughs> hey, Hello. Hi. Hi. How are you? All right, so I am, and she's got her new logo. Yes. You got your new logo? Okay, hang on, you got to show. I have a new logo. There, she's got her new logo. That is awesome. Now you rock speak. it, girl. Woohoo! All Thank right. you. We're going to spam back around. Yeah. Are you guys you going to dinner this? tonight? Yes. yes. Good. I will meet you there, but we're okay. live. So <laughs> we're going to move on. Dinner tonight? With the Anita? designer. Rita? Yeah. No. No, no, not Rita. Um, the one that I need to put together. With Anita. Yes. Anita. Yes, that no, one. I did. When I saw, I was from Oh, okay. Got it. I got it. I got it. You too. Congratulations. All right. So here we go. Ningbo Liberty Port Trading Company. What is this? Sorry. Impromptu little like meeting of friends. Stamp fasteners. Um, not quite sure what this is, but it looks like it's kind of cool. Sewing stuff. Stamp fasteners with tools. We'll come back to that another time. All right, let's come over here. So here we have Krylon. Do a quickie. Ooh, those are pretty looking. 
anything geometric that you can spray paint. So this is their glitter finish decorative clear top coat. Here we go. So here we have Rust-Oleum. They have some spray paints here. Very cool. Oh, I'm so glad you guys are having fun. Thank you for stopping. I'm trying to get through and not have, so here's Test Doors. They have a fabric paint from Test Doors that we have over here. So, I mean, here you can see I'm not the only one filming. So like there's Alex over there doing her job. We're all doing it, we're all busting our butts over here. <laughs> all right, so just a quick snapshot. Everybody's doing their thing over here. Here we have um, a Verathane white wash. And then we have a Color Watch 2020, Colors to Watch for 2020. So the two times ultra color, all for Mustoleum. There's another side little corner one I'm just gonna pop into real fast. New and Zella, so if you're into yarn, yarn is here, so the TNNA, which is the yarn and lots of fabrics. We'll do a quickie run through with one of them in a video. I don't do a whole lot with that, but you know, fabric is kind of cool. Can't get it, but look at the cool yarns. Love that, all right. We're gonna span around. You guys can see all the crazy, 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 crazy happening here. Look at all the people. Look at all the people that are here. That is awesome. Okay, so here we have Krylon Iridescent. Very cool. Let me try and get away from so the Krylon Iridescent over here. All right, let me stand back up. There's lots of cameras out. People are doing all kinds of stuff. All right, what do we got? I don't know if anybody else is live though. That's the part I don't know. Is Anne live? Here's Anne, Chuckle Coleman. <laughs> All right, so here we have Diamond Dots. So here is Diamond Dots Freestyle Art. Um, very cool. Is this the one that is all-purpose dotting adhesive? So they have an adhesive from Diamond Dots. Very cool. This is the one that is, okay. I don't know if I can officially, I don't know if I can announce this yet. I have something going on with this, with Diamond Dots. I have been a part of this particular project. I was, I didn't wanna, so there is something coming where I am a part of what you are seeing in this little box right here. So it'll be coming March. It is very cool. And so, yeah, I'll be, lots and lots of fun um, announcements coming with that very, very soon. So yeah, I teamed up with Leisure Arts and Diamond Dots and we got some, some cool stuff. So Erin Reed's got kind of her own product, but not exactly, anyway. A little bit something coming up. All right, so Deco Art. This is their suede paint from Deco Art. All right. Over here we have designer finishes. This is all Deco Art. And we had over here. Here we have their silk paint. Talk nerdy to me. <laughs> I missed it. It's, I have to go, always go back and watch these videos because I'm so. I, I'm looking at what the product is and trying to tell you a company that I don't I miss all the fun stuff And then this one is the holographic illusions paint. So where's the one that said talk? What was it? Was it on here? No, it was on the other one now I got to go see what you meant about that Talking yeah, so it was the sign talk nerdy to me. <laughs> I love it. Okay made with good vibes What is this? Yeah, it was the diamond. Dust. See, I just figured that <laughs> All right, so booth 701, this is Fabric Editions, and they have Made With Good Buys. Looks like it's a little kits and stuff. Those are so stinking adorable. Pom-poms, kits. Look at the little cute unicorns. I love it. Absolutely, this is the Felt Friends ornament. So they have kits is what I'm kind of getting at. So here's the kit for the, for the little unicorn, and then they have a kit over here that is a wall hanging kit that is for the Rainbow, that's the word, rainbow. <laughs> I can't talk, apparently. Rainbow is the word. All right, moving on around the corner. Here we go. Here we have Odif non-slip coating. Not really sure. Somebody's not standing here. Sometimes I have to do my best guess about what this is. It's a non-slip coating, so nobody seems to be here right now telling me what this is. Okay, there we go. Non-slip coating, that's what I got for you. I like it when they're standing next to their booth. Are you live too? Yeah. Yo, well, girl. I'm not, I'm not live, I'm just like. Oh man, you gotta go live. You know what? Um, Hang on. I, I'm a bag lady right now. So here's VA. Hey guys. Fuck yourself, girl. Hi, <laughs> my name is AV of avdoeswhat.com. Not VA, AV, sorry. Oh, yeah. I'm tired. You know Virginia, AV, No, but I knew thing, that. But I not knew really. That. I'm adorable. Yes. 
but I am a V of avdoeswhat.com, the DIY and lifestyle blog. If you love thrifting, upcycling, please follow me because I live in New York and I do a lot of curve finding and like dumpster diving, but like not in the dumpster. Yeah. <laughs> you are not the dumpster lady. Now show what you got going on there. What is that lady. thing? Okay, so. So she is working with Beacon working and. With Beacon. So we're that doing is so a cute. whole bunch of different uh, make and takes. This is the wine bottle holder like decorating. Right. So we're going to be doing this. It's going to be like blingy, pink, because yeah. why not? And we're is that be pink or peach? Pink, peach. Peach, you know, okay, yeah. We're cousins. <laughs> and also, but there's more. There's always but more. Right. There's always there's more. more. Oops, I went the wrong way. Oh, a little tassels. Tassel keychains. Very cute. Your make and take. So, awesome. Yeah. You if go, you girl. Happen to come here, or you're gonna be here. Stop by. Yeah. Thanks. Most of them aren't, but I love the fact that that was all made with beacon and felt, and yeah, just yeah. like up taking something and upcycling. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Fabulous. Fabulous. Lots of ideas. Thank you. Okay. You are so awesome. All right. So here we have high standard products. Um, not quite. Oh, knitting stuff. So it's knitting stuff. That's the best thing I can tell you. Um, Av. Uh, Av. What's your site again? I just got asked. What's your site again? Plug it. A V, like audio visual. Yep. Not A V I. A V does what? Show it. Pow. Sometimes there it is. A V does what? Does what? Do they see it backwards? No. Nope. No. Yeah, it's good, normal. Good. Yeah. Yep. This is me. A V does what? All right. There you go. Thank you guys. <laughs> okay. So over here we have cork fabric. I'm gonna go over here. It's very, very busy right there. So these are cork fabrics. Span down so you guys can see. Cork fabrics from Cork Bellagio. It's very busy in this corner all of a sudden. All right, we got Thermo Web with Rena. We're live on YouTube. Is there any? I know I just totally bumped into this conversation, but oh no, it's okay. Is there anything you want to tell us what's going on with what you got here? There are so many things I want to tell you about this product right here. So this is my first line with Thermo Web. I'm you so, go, girl. You so go blessed girl. that they actually took the time to take me seriously. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Jokes on them. And <laughs> oh, you're amazing. So these, um, I created these electro pop inks over the summer, and I really wanted to bring. Uh, loud collection like I like things that are so visually exciting that they cross senses into being loud you know it reminds so, me of my teenage years in the 90s yep and I so <laughs> vaporwave there's a there's a thing right now that's called vaporwave where it's bringing back that 80s and 90s aesthetic right. mixed with kind of like a new feel right. and a big part of it is neon yeah. and pink mm -hmm. And, and I wore blue neon and stuff. So what we wanted to do is we wanted to take the traditional highlighter colors that you find with our Hello Yellow, Pop and Pink, Screaming Green, and Orange Glow, and we made a new product. This is called Neon Enamel. So if you don't know, I have very I have an invested interest into my nails. And we wanted to create something that kind of gives the same effect as like shiny polish almost. And this neon enamel is similar, it works the same exact way as the deco foil. Okay. But when you have neon, it kind of get a lot if you were doing like a reflective gel. So we wanted to keep the shine but also maintain all the neon ability. And then if you still want the glitter, over here we have the colors in the Blitz glitter gel. Here we go. And just to reiterate, this Blitz glitter gel is made with just pigmented glitter and a clear gel, so there's no dye in there that can ruin the project. It's just glitter in there. So it's really dense, it's nice, nice paste, so much fun to apply. So your mom's got the, the neutral tones, the cool tones, and you're like, I'm going neon. I'm like, let's go. <laughs> <It's color. laughs> I love it, I love it. Yep. And so then, cool. of course, we also have Flock, which is like fuzzies. Oh, flocking in there too? Yep. There's okay. Flock, which adds fuzzies to your card if you not only want to Look at them and feel happy. You can touch them and feel happy. Very so cool. we have those. How many eight colors too. did you launch? Uh, so there's eight electric pop yes. neon colors. Very cool. But um, we just wanted to start with yeah. these and then Great. hopefully move on into more. Awesome. <laughs> okay, I gotta show everybody what your uh, little. 
Wait, 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 I went the wrong way on my camera. There we go. Look at her. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> so you totally like brought everybody like. <laughs> I know. I've just been sitting here like, does anyone want to know about my product? <laughs> yes, we do. Of course. Do you got stamps in the back too? Yep. So these are the stamp and stencil systems. So there's dies, a stencil, and then stamps that all correspond and match with each other. So with just one set of them, you can create a million different looks. I made about 24 ice cream cones with this, and just the flock enamel and glitz between all of them, you can create a ton of different looks. So it really is a universal set, and it is a set that you can get so many different uses out of. Is and this then, out yet? This is going to be released. This will be available March 1st. Awesome. Okay. But we're releasing it now. Right, right, right. Yeah. So for people to purchase it March 1st. Mm -hmm. Very cool. Well, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Awesome. All right, so deco foil, we got more stuff. So much cool stuff. All right, so here we have so more of the neon flocking from her, from Marina, and then we've got. Sorry, hello, I'm totally like bumping. Eight. What are you gonna tell me? Okay, do you do you want me to walk you through? I totally want you to walk okay. you through. Okay, you know it more than I do. I'm trying to like. Uh, there's that crap in the corner. Yeah, they're new. New. Okay. Um, so we've got two new formulas of deco foil transfer gel. Um, we've replaced the original. Um, okay. The one we're super excited about is the Transfer Gel Duo. You no longer need a hot laminator to transfer seriously? foil and flux seriously. Wow. So you stencil it on, it'll dry clear and stay tacky, uh -huh. and then you can run it through your laminator or your die cut machine, foil or flock, or awesome. Rena's new enamels. Right. Oh, her enamels work too with it. Okay, they so will. any of the transfer stuff that you have. Will work with great. Duo. Great, great, great. The other product is Transfer Gel Blanco, which is like our original Transfer Gel, but now it dries white, you still need a laminator, but it's going to create better color accuracy on top of the inked backgrounds or dark cardstock. Okay. So if you see this little panel in the middle was done with the duo and white flock, this okay. is Blanco and white flock. So it's just, it's more vibrant. Very, very cool. So we're really excited. It is exciting. So, That's awesome. Yeah. When are those going to get launched? Uh, everything will ship March 1st. March, okay. So yeah. everything's kind of coming out March 1st. Yeah. Right? The whole kit and doodle. Yeah. Awesome. Well, yeah. thank you. Are you guys going to be demoing any of this stuff? All of it. Tomorrow. All of it. All right. Yeah. Well, obviously, that's yeah. two yeah. days. All right. Yeah. So i got to come by and you guys are going to see how this stuff is working. Awesome. How awesome it is. We'll see ya. Woohoo. <laughs> thank you. Okay. So over here. Gone. Hi. Oh. Uh, we're well, going to go oh, up and over. Are, yeah. No, no, no. You're good. You're good. Okay. Anybody yeah, excited about pictures? So. Purple tape, awesome purple tape. We got light tack pixie spray. And then we saw over there, look at the Gina K colors. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I love it. Okay. And there's some more glitz, glitter gel. Very cool. Okay, so what do we have over here? Oh, hi, Shelly. Hi. I am good. How are you? I am good. So here's Dress My Craft. You guys have been asking me about Dress My Craft. Here we go. What do we got? Okay, so what we have today is the shaker elements. And if you want to ask them what are they good for, I think they are good for your eyes. <laughs> they are so <laughs> cute. You want to eat them, but you don't eat them. But yeah, don't eat them. Don't eat them. Edible, but <laughs> let me just tell you, they are the cutest shaker elements. They are. So you can create like shaker tags, you can do shaker cards with them. You can do the slime with them. We have done some keychains. So if you see our little snow globes here, we are setting these plastic snow globes as well. So you can make like sizes as per your choice. Like we have a small one, we have a bigger one. We have a lot of them. And just to give you a little effect, how do they look like? We have taken a desert mix. So if you see, this is a desert mix here. Mm -hmm. We have taken the desert mix from here, and then actually we have mixed it with our flower folds. So you can do DIY shakers. Oh, yes. They are so amazing, and you don't have to really think about that. You don't have something. We can mix it up with flower pearls and create something what you're looking for. Awesome. And look at this one. So if you see the penguins here, and maybe oh, yeah, yeah, I, see yeah, the yeah, yeah, I think they're the cutest ones. They are people cute. Really, yeah, people really, really love them. That's awesome. Yeah. Thank Ooh. you. So you're going to be doing some of these make and takes in your booth, right? Uh, not something. for this one. We have a lot of other make and takes happening, you know, but not. But if you look at this one, we have a dyes and everything. But yes, okay. if you have another booth, that's the shrink prank. Okay. So we're doing a demo for that as well. All right. Well, awesome. Thank you. Look forward. Oh, yeah. All right, moving along, moving along. What do we got over here? All right, guys, some more. Dress by craft. All right, we got so shrink, shrink, shrink. Yeah, this is shrink, shrink, and it is a very versatile product. You can oh, see this is. Here we go. I, I don't want to have the thing in the way. So here we go. This is frosted on one side, and 
this is, you know, transparent on the other side. Oh, so oh, it is it's very paper. versatile. It's this kind of a paper. It is in A4 size. It's a pack of 10 sheets. Okay. And you can see on the frosted side, you can use your soft pastels. You can use watercolors, color pencils. On the shiny side, you can use your Sharpies, your Copics. You can stamp on it. You can hand cut it. You can die cut it. Right. You can use it the way you want it. And thereafter, we use our ball tools and using help of heat gun, we heat emboss it. Using the shaping tools, we shape it and you can create beautiful neck pieces. So all of these all pieces of here this. are made. And that. loads you know, more is there at the booth, so you can visit the booth to have a And you guys are going to show us how it's going to work. Yeah, we awesome. have a and tea, and we also have, you know, a kind of demos for the same. Okay. So you can visit the booth and you can... Very cool. Thank you. All right. So somebody was asking about the vinyl thing. Uh, well, one thing about the vinyl is that it may not be out. Um, it may be on their website, but it may not be on Amazon yet. So just heads up. When they say the release date, it still might take a week or two before it shows up in all the stores. So here we have Clover Swift Bead. So something about me. Ooh, I remember sitting here like doing beading on whatever, and it took forever. So that is awesome. That's got like a swift beading thing. Very, very cool. All right, Lawn Pond's got their new thing. We've kind of already played around with that. We're going to come back. She looks busy. All right, so over here we have Eco Wash Bag. Soap, soap lunches. So it's all for like washing all of your wools and things and all of your yarny doodads. All right, so walking around over here, we have Flex Knit Needles. Remember I told you there's a whole knitting section that's part of this show it's now. It's $11. So Flex Knit Needles. Awesome. So they're bendable? Yes, they are. Very cool. Bendable needles for all of you that are into knitting and knitting. Not crocheting, knitting. <laughs> all right. And then over here we have, come see what, Haya Haya. So it's a different kind of, I'm not really into the crocheting and the knitting and stuff. So that's kind of cool. Awesome. If you're into that. There you go. All right. What's this over here? Oh, I already showed that. And I already got, oh, there's one more over here. Are you part of this? Yeah, we're We are live on YouTube. Is there anything you want to tell me? Uh, well, yeah, we're from Australia. Oh, awesome. And this is our 100% ethical and sustainable yarn range that we've brought across here. Okay. Um, yeah. We have, um, so this is Great Southern, Great Southern yarn. yarn. Are you guys getting hit with all the fires? Not us personally, but we you know, have a very people. smoky town. Oh, <laughs> so. I'm so sorry. Thank Hope you. Hope everybody's okay. So we 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 get uh, we run sheep on a merino property. They have nine thousand merino, and the person who owns the property is a rural fire chief, and he spent one month in the last three months fighting the fires. Jesus. Outside yeah. of his. That's, that's crazy. when he's not crazy. Hand that's feeding not the sheep because of the drought. Right. Oh god. Yeah. You guys are just getting nailed left and right. So. Yeah. Oh yeah. my gosh. But this is so pretty. Is it like probably super soft too, right? It's super, it's super soft. Yeah. Oh, is this what? Okay. Yeah. So here's this is our full ply. Oh, so pretty. So Thank we do you. a merino base and a merino alpaca mix. Okay. Very cool. Thirty. So greatsouthernyarn.com. Got it. All right. Well, I showed the little picture on there. So thank you so thank much. You. Thank, thank you. Appreciate you so much, Aaron. Yes. All, right. All right. Here's my card, just in case. You do a lot of this stuff. Yes. There you go. Terrific. Are you called thank an influencer? you. Yes, I am. That is me. I am an influencer. <laughs> thank you. All right. So we missed Lawn Pond, so we're gonna go back to Lawn Pond. Other than that, I think I hit everybody else. So we're gonna make our way. So I think there was a couple people asking what I was doing. Sorry, I was. I don't want to interrupt anybody when they're talking and trying to influence. So I am. I'm gonna flip the camera around. So here we go. I am at Creativation, which is Creativation 2020, which is an it's a combined trade show slash education for anybody who's in the craft, influencer, art. Uh, there's yarn, as you can see, anything that's kind of DIY that has anything that you can make and create. So it's the Creative Industries, um, Association for Creative Industries. This is the big trade show of the year that we have, and we are in Air Phoenix, Arizona, and this is a new product showcase. So I think we're hitting our last booth right now, our last little one. All right, we got Lawn Fawn here. I know we got some funnies. <laughs> I was in both your classes, yes? Yeah, so it was pretty good, right? It was good, it, was, yeah. Yeah, it looked a little daunting at first, and then she like explained it like anything, and it went so easy. And then I did it the second time in the second class, and it was like, oh, this is like, done. Yeah, and it was one of those, you do it once, and you're like, 
Oh, I get it. And yeah. I actually even recommend the first time someone does it that they use up old scrap paper. Okay. And use that and just So she's talking it about her new magic time, iris, which you guys saw in the class. And some of her new papers. It gets it under your belt I'm gonna go and around. Oh, with the video. There we go. And then you're able to make a card decorate. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. I don't want to like you guys keep talking, and I'll just show because I've already kind of a little bit about this. So here was one of the new paper packs that we talked about. So this was the um, sheets of fun. I'm not sure what this one's called, but it had all the daisies on it. Here we go. This is the new Magic Iris. This thing was so cool. You guys saw where I did the video live while she was explaining. Kelly was explaining it, and it was absolutely so cute. I love it. So it really is not as hard as you think once you kind of get going on it. And I will be making another one at home with you guys. So probably both because I have both kits. Which and now that I have the video to go back and look at, there we go. So there we go. I'm gonna span up again. You guys can see. Oh, we have lots of people saying that they're funny. <laughs> She's busy. I don't want to interrupt her. I'll come back in a second. We can go through. All right. I think we have hit just about everybody. So as you can see, it's still pretty busy. People are still coming in. They're still checking stuff out. They're still kind of investigating everything. I think we hit just. A hey, I am good. Busy, busy, busy. Oh no, I think I see one I missed. Oh no, that was the soap one. So I think this is it. So the companies have gone through and decided this is the product that they want to have in here. Oh, no, I did miss one, I think. Did I do the whitewash paint from Krylon? There we go, whitewash paint from Krylon, that is there. I think I've gotten everybody else. I think we've kind of hit everybody. Just doing one last pass, I think we got them all though. Uh, yeah, there's the beading thing. So I was, I don't, I don't know how much longer she's gonna be talking. So I'm gonna go ahead and sign us. We know we're gonna go by Lawn Con and we will get a booth tour with either Jen or with Kelly about Lawn Con specifically. Thank you guys so much for joining in. We had 155 people watching. That's where we're at right now. You guys are amazing. 556 <laughs> and it keeps on going. So if you were ever interested in what the new products are for this com coming year, this is what is coming, and there are probably some other ones. They just did not get the new products, so you know that's what I'll be doing for the next three days on the showroom floor, going around, doing booth demos of all the different people, all the different companies that are here at Creativation 2020, launching their products, all the new stuff they have to offer. And I will be bringing them to you live and recorded as much as I possibly can to get you guys involved. And I will do my best to try and answer the questions that you guys have. Um, most of the products, I will tell you, will not be launching. A few of them are live. Most of them will not be launching probably for like up until like March, maybe February, maybe April. Kind of depends on the product. But I will do my best to ask them while we are talking with them. So thank you again. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that bell button so you get notifications for future videos that I'll be doing live the next few days. All right. Bye, everybody.